camo progression welcome back to week one so the game's been out just over a week now but i filmed the first one of these on the sunday we're now this is technically the second one but because the game's been out technically a full week now this is week one now i show basically all my camo progressions that i've made in that week and boys there's been some big changes and some annoying ones holy i've never been so 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 annoyed at this game in my life but i'm all done with it now so i'm happy now so if i go over to my guns here you can see if i click this one and go to camos you'll see i got forged i have forged so i got every single ar gold now and you can see over here we are nine out of 36 on the price list that's because i probably did some of the worst guns by the way this and these two burst guns Ugh. I ended up going into hardcore to do these because they were that bad. They were just, they just were so bad. It's the exact same thing with these battle rifles. Don't get me wrong, this Bass B is probably still, I don't know if I said it last time, but this Bass B is my favorite gun I've used so far because of how much it shreds. It just absolutely destroys. You'd think, oh, the other battle rifles, oh, they'll be okay then if this one destroys. This one, absolute wank holy crap this one pea shooter what's the fucking point what is the point the battle rifles the battle rifles and they're getting you know they're supposed to hit harder than normal assault rifles but they just don't hit as hard you know this mtz 556 known as a pea shooter but that hits harder than both of these two combined it's a joke but anyway they're done now I have, I have them forged, so I don't have to use them again until then, <laughs> until priceless, but I'm miles off priceless yet. As I was playing this and was using these shit guns, again, I did do these two in hardcore because they were just so unbearable in, in core. Honest to God, with this gun, you've got to wait three working days for it to shoot the next bullet. The fire rate is that fucking slow. It's just, it's just unbearable. You can't use it in, in core. Well, no, you can, but it's... Why would you put yourself through the pain, basically, when it just one hit in hardcore? So that's why I did both of these in hardcore. This one had a little bit more fire rate. Obviously, it was a little bit quicker, but it, it, it just it didn't hit. You can see both of these have the exact same damage. Like, there's no difference. Obviously, there's a difference in fire rate and mobility. That's the biggest piece of bullshit I've experienced in this game so far. And I know what there is to come in the smgs because that's what we're moving on to next and i know that we have to do this one and i know this one's a bit of a pain in the ass as well one thing i did realize when using these battle rifles is i'm being punished for having an above average kd i'll show you my kd my kd last time was like a 1.27 it was something a little high i've mudded it I've, I've mudded it to try and get some fucking easier games I am purposely now, purposely at mudding my KD just so I can get some enjoyable games because the game just <laughs> punishes you for having a high KD. I don't see why it does that. I'm not saying you should be rewarded and get easier lobbies. I just think that the SBMM or skill-based matchmaking is so fucking strict in this game that it's not worth tryharding to get put into lobbies where you have to sweat your fucking ass off to get a camo here's some stats anyway for these guns again i was using like double xp and all that to level these guns up here's my bass p we got 30 34 percent accuracy 13 percent headshot 1.44 kd like i said this is my favorite gun i felt like i was shredding with this gun so much it was it was a joke so we had just under 400 kills with that we then had the sidewinder which by the way awful gun <laughs> walking out torture using that bastard tell you what get a terrorist sat down in an interrogation room stick this game on force him to use the sidewinder all the shit would spew out from him you would find out the deepest and darkest secrets ever just give him this gun so i just maintain just under a 1kd with it but that's terrible it's absolutely terrible got just under three uh just under 320 kills with it we've got 319 we maintained a 25 percent accuracy so one in four bullets hit which yeah yeah again the recoil on this gun as well by the way is a little bit a bit mad the headshot percentage is 15 percent we'll round it down but yeah 15 percent the next gun we used we got minimal minimal amount of kills with 279 
and we've got it forged. That's pretty sick if you ask me. We managed to maintain a 1.17 KD with that thing as well with a 20... 29% accuracy and a 20% headshot accuracy, which is again, it's okay. It's not bad. It's not bad at all. Uh, so this DG58 is shutting out I used, which is the burst, which is one of the bursts. I think it's the it's the weaker of the two bursts. It has a faster fire rate than the FAMAS, but it's a bit weaker. Got 287 kills with that, with a 1.26 KD with it, and a 29% accuracy with a 22.3% headshot accuracy pretty good okay not bad the famous we actually got the least kills with in 244 we've already got it forged which is insane absolutely insane but again hardcore hardcore you get more xp for your guns with a double xp token so you're just getting so much more that that is the best way i found out to level up weapons so far now i know that there's a way you can do it through zombies but i know they've tweaked the zombies through an update this week and it's a little bit i don't i, I don't know if it's still good for leveling up guns i will give it a go though i might give it a go with some smgs actually but yeah we maintained a 1.3 kd with that with a 20 percent accuracy not not the highest accuracy on that that gun at all really not the highest accuracy on that gun with a 15.6 uh 16 headshot accuracy which is okay it's okay but i would like those stats to be a little bit higher if i'm being honest what else we got here that well, that's 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 just doable and to show you i suppose i could show you some leaderboard stuff it's not again not the greatest i'm i'm in like the top five percent in i guess the world again i don't really go off fucking wins and games and things like that there's people that have genuinely put fucking seven days into the game how <laughs> i just don't i don't see like kills i got 1.17 kd the top three percent in the world this is why it's fucking me over in s with sbmm is because i'm top three percent in the world i don't want to be there so i'm plummeting my kd now 1.17 to me isn't high but according to this game, <laughs> holy shit, it's like I'm getting put into CDL lobbies every fucking game. Now, critical damage, by the way. I, I like to I like to take like to take some pride in, in what I'm good at with. I'm good at, I'm pretty good. I feel as if I'm pretty good at getting headshots on people. So I have like a, I have an 18% headshot accuracy, which eh, is not the highest I've ever had. It's about the average that I get in every Call of Duty. But again, I'm in the top 3%. You can see that just below me. That's going to be it for today's video. Just again, wanted to run down through any, all the stats and tell you my favorite guns, my worst guns. Worst gun has got to be the Sidewinder. That was pretty horrific. Either the Sidewinder or the MT762. This has got to be a pretty bad gun. My favourite one so far is still the Bass P. It hasn't changed. Maybe that'll change when we get to do some SMGs. And I'll give you an update on that next week. So if you are new around here and you want to hit that subscribe button, please do. That would be amazing. We are trying to hit a 1,000 subs. We're still quite a ways off, but only you guys can change that. And if you do want to see the camo grind live, hit notification. I, so I literally, sh most days, whenever I'm camo grinding. So you can see all the highlights, the ups, the downs... The, the rage the, everything you can see everything so if that's not another reason to subscribe then hey what is right i don't know what is and i will see you later goodbye